Hey, hey! Today, um, we're going to start from the basics. Uh, this is what sold me on Norwex and why I love it so much. Um, it's kind of gross. Some people don't like it, right? So today we have our friend the chicken breast versus the Enviro cloth. So this guy is just a plain Enviro cloth. All the cloths say the name of the cloth. So Enviro is E for everything. I don't know if you can see. Oh, here it is. I'm sorry. There you go. E for everything. Enviro has the back lock. It's dry right now, but I'm about to wet it and then we'll get started. I'm just wetting it in the sink with just water. And so you wring it out so it shouldn't be dripping everywhere. Wet. So what I'm going to do is fold it so the tag is on the top when I'm working so that we could use the same surface the whole time, okay? So there's our tag at the top. So I'm going to use that side when I'm cleaning, okay? Um, what we have is our chicken breast, a plate, and then these guys are protein swabs. Uh, like the health department uses. Um, so once we apply the chicken, it has a, I don't know if you can see the green. It starts with green, so green over here. Can you see it? Means no protein is present. And then the darker it is, the more protein is on the surface. All right, so let's see, we have a clean plate. We're gonna get our chicken breast. We love chicken breast, right? Always chicken breast is like a, I don't know, something we love to eat and eat it often, but like the cleanup of it is gross, right? All right, there's our chicken. So what we're going to do is swab the surface, the little swab. And I'm sure that this is going to light up super dark purple for protein being present on the surface. Let's put it in. Then there's a little solution in the top that I'm gonna break. Boom. There it go. Oh, there it goes. And we swoosh around. Mm -hmm. Let me get the liquid down there, come on. So you shake it a little bit. And it's getting darker and darker. You see it's getting dark. I don't think I swabbed enough. Let's swab. And we're swabbing. Okay, so that's the surface with the chicken. Oh, there we go. Here is our purple. Very dark purple. So if you look at the little thing, purple, there's protein on the surface from my chicken juice. See, it's gross, there it is. See the purple? So now all we're gonna do, tag side up, is we're just gonna wipe it with that, <clears throat> with the EnviroCloth. Now what the EnviroCloth's doing is removing the chicken yuck from the surface. That's it. All right, so tag that up. Let's re swab it with the new one. So here's our yucky one. That's purple. We'll swab it again. Make sure I get her enough this time, right? <laughs> then you break the liquid into it. Ooh, there it goes. And you can see, green. So all of the yuck is here and not here. You get a feel? And I'm gonna lick the plate. So we've removed all the chicken from the plate. So you see, there's the before and there's the after. See them? Pretty cool. Now I am going to introduce a third swab 
for, I'm gonna wipe back here with the same side, just to show that it doesn't cross contaminate. So here's our two with our clean plate now. There's nothing on it. Nice and clean, see it shining? So here's the two colors, purple. This is when it was there, and this is when it's not. And you see it only took me a couple of seconds to like, you know? So tag side up. There's the tag. The same side that I wiped all the yuck, we're gonna wipe over here on my stove. And then we're gonna take the, the third swab and see if it deposited anything over here. They go all the way around like I did. So this is the demo that sold me like on Norwex for forever. And you can see we're green over there. So what it does is hold everything inside uh, and takes it off the surface. So we've cleaned this with the same surface. I've wiped over here. We got another green. So it's not depositing. There you go. Oop, I'm put on the plates. <laughs> so you can see them. There you go. So this, the purple one is when I put the chicken juice. This is our plate. And then this is my um, stove. Awesome. Now all you do with this, run it under one, running water and scrub it against itself to release all those yucks from the microfiber. Hang it safely to dry, either like this or on a um, towel rack like that. And the back lock, the silver embedded inside will purify and you're ready for the next mess. You don't even have to wash it right away. Um, I wash mine every 10 to 14 days. Uh, so that's awesome. Um, let me know if you have further questions and I hope you enjoy this demo. Have a great day.